The gold of the Americas exhibition is divided into four main parts. The first, the flesh of the gods, portrays the special relationship pre-Columbian peoples had with gold. Over 70 objects are on exhibit, drawn from collections in Colombia, Peru, Mexico, and New York's Metropolitan Museum. The second part of the exhibition depicts the encounter between Europeans and the pre-Columbian peoples using a collection of objects from Spain, Portugal, Ireland and France. The exhibition's third zone, Dream Chasers, tells of the California and Klondike gold rushes. The fourth and final part of the exhibition, The King of Metals, explores the properties of the metal itself and its contemporary uses. At the center of the hall is an installation featuring gold ingots and a one million dollar gold piece. The main attraction of Gold of the Americas will be, without a doubt, the objects on display. A second highlight of the exhibition involves its design. The third highlight of the exhibit is its audio-visual side, which includes special environmental films. Finally, there's a major publication to go with the exhibition, The Gold of the Americas, in three words, contemporary, committed and treasures.